Hey everyone, it's Pat from Pat's Music and we're going to quickly learn All the Stars by Kendrick Lamar and of course it's featured in the Black Panther movie. Such an amazing movie, highly recommend, best superhero film I've seen in a long time. Now this song is just four chords, but a lot of awesome songs are four chords. Definitely grab your guitar if you're a beginner, you're just starting out. Skip here for a one finger or sort of bass line sort of method. If you can play power chords and you're an intermediate guitarist, check out this method. Otherwise, if you're an advanced guitarist and you can play bar chords, Let's learn it right now. So grab your guitars, the first chord is an A flat major chord. And that's how you play it there with all the different fingerings. Then go back and then you play on the same string, you play the F minor chord. And you do that again. So you're actually halfway there. Next you go down and you make this C minor shape. And then you jump up a string and you do G minor. You do that again. And that's the entire song. Two, three, four. Two, three, and again. Two, three, four. And C minor. Two, three, four. Two, three, and again. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. Now that's the entire song. If it sounded a little bit, you know, sort of lifeless, Definitely put in some rhythm, but that's it. That's the entire song. So you could sort of strum it. You could maybe sort of in the verse, when sort of the rapping and stuff is sort of going on, you could maybe just let it sort of flow and ring out. And then you could start strumming when it hits the chorus. That would be one different way, but it's those four chords the entire way. So when you get up to the chorus, you start on the A flat to F minor, and then you just continue through the entire length of the song. That's it, great job. Did you like it? Did you like the movie? Definitely like this video if you learned something and let me know below if you enjoyed the movie. Otherwise, we're gonna check out the intermediate method and the beginner method. But thanks for watching. I'll see you for another video, bye. Now the intermediate method, we're gonna show you power chords, not bar chords, and it's only four chords. So dive on in, you can definitely do it. So with the intermediate method, you wanna have a power chord up on the fourth fret of the sixth string. There's the fingerings. Then you go back to the first fret, same string group. Then you do that again. First fret. Then you drop down to the third fret on the fifth string, make a C power chord. Then up a string. Then down again. Then up a string. That's the entire song. You can certainly add some more rhythm. Or what you could do is maybe let it ring out for the verse, but then for the chorus when it's all the stars, you could sort of build it up that way. But that's it, that's the entire song. So it goes from the fourth fret, first fret. Repeat that again. Third fret. And again. Then you would start again. That's it. That's the end of the video. Great job for making it through. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Otherwise, I'll see you all again, maybe tomorrow. Bye. All right, so you're starting out, you're a beginner. Great job for wanting to learn new songs. And sort of once you can play this with one finger, maybe check out the intermediate method. So this is with one finger, come right on in and use your first finger on the fourth fret of the sixth string. You just play that fourth fret, then you go back to the first fret. Then you repeat that again. Back to the first fret. Then third fret on the fifth string, then up a string. Do that again, down a string, and up a string. Now that's it. That's the entire song. It's just four chords. It's A flat major, F minor, C minor, and then G minor. Now, if that just went whoosh, all over your head, just play that one finger method and maybe sort of keep it, let it ring out for the verse. But then for the chorus, Maybe build it up and sort of strum. Maybe play each note eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Once you can do that, try the power chords. 
Once you can do that, try the full chords. But that's it, it's literally those four chords. So if you start at the verse, it's those four chords. If you start at the chorus, it's those four chords. That's it, if you enjoyed this video, if you learned something, leave a like. If you enjoyed the movie or you like the song, leave a comment below. I'll see you all again in another video, bye.